Good day, YouTubers, friends, and family from across the world. This is Mike with Morning Dew Daily Events Worldwide. We are on October 21st, 2018. Welcome to another surviving day on this planet. Thank you for joining me today as we're going to start off by looking at the sun as I always enjoy the imagery coming off of the sun. It's electrifying. Large plasma filaments dancing around the sphere. active sunspot region and a coronal hole in the northern hemisphere staying aware and prepared a lot of strange things going on today this is a volcano in the Aleutian Islands two days ago erupting not an explosive eruption but definitely sending molten magma down the side this volcano in Alaska. A United States volcano is flowing a very large magma river. And I've been reporting over the last few days all of the volcano alerts that I've been getting across the planet. And also strange earthquakes Tobago region, the 5.2 there. But just looking at all these volcanoes, the Dis Pacific Disaster Center, every hour or so, I'm getting an update. So stay aware and prepared, folks. This is why Morning Dew is here for you, reporting all of these active regions, volcanoes, earthquakes, and extreme weather events. So that image that I was showing you earlier, the volcano in Alaska, that is this volcano right here, Velimianov, just became active, hasn't been active in a long time, but this is the volcano here, right on the islands of the Aleutian Islands. Benimianov. Very active volcano right now. And looking around this map right now, North America, South America being inundated with floods, storms, volcanoes, and earthquakes. So please stay aware and prepared. My heart, my thoughts, my prayers go out to everyone around the world as I'm praying for humanity to survive this cataclysmic time that we are going through. We're going to look at the earthquakes here. 5.9 Southwest Indian Ridge late last night. That's a pretty large earthquake for this area. As well as this 5.2 in Trinidad and Tobago region at an 18 kilometer depth. Still watching activity in Hawaii as well, but a lot of very deep earthquakes recently. It's a little bit concerning. This is the last seven days for earthquakes around the world. Every plate line experiencing large movement. South America experiencing a lot of very deep earthquakes, but still looks very quiet in between the western side of the ring of fire and the eastern side so staying aware and prepared we need to be ready for a large earthquake in North America I have a lot of friends and family on the coastline western North America Vancouver so stay aware and prepared guys that's all I can say here we're looking at tropical storm Willa who is projected to turn into a category 4 storm over the next 12 to 24 hours and yeah kind of like um, a Michael Hurricane Michael scenario again luckily it didn't uh, form 
further south, it might have done the same thing. But there is Vicente and Willa, and they're probably joined forces for that Category 4. We've also got another tropical cyclone forming in the Pacific Ocean. This is tropical cyclone number 31. That's right, 31. They've gone five letters past the regular alphabet. We'll see what this one will be named. But it looks like a pretty intense storm already. It's going to be heading straight west. This projected model sends it northwest. But looking at European models, brought to you by Meteor Earth and Meteo Mike, here's your five day forecast. European models are showing here Tropical Storm Willa to head straight across Mexico and then into Texas and the whole Gulf. Quite possibly to form a tropical storm for the southeastern United States as well. I mean, it'll be a Category 4 when it hits landfall tomorrow. Canada. Eastern parts of Canada will be receiving a blizzard later in the week, showing there. Still cool temperatures at night, but still, during the day here, the temperature in Alberta is really fluctuating back and forth. And that's due to this still large Pacific low, bringing a lot of equatorial air towards us. Watching five day forecast for tropical storm number 31. You can see it heads northwest for a bit, but then this forecast shows it heading straight west. So we'll see what happens here over the next couple days, but it will be a category four storm in two days. So that's two category four storms that will be raging on our planet in the next 24 hours. Stay aware and prepare Japan and also the Philippines because that thing could head straight west. Also watching in the Indian Ocean for possible cyclone development again. But parts of eastern Africa here, Ethiopia, believe it or not, yeah, they're going to be getting some flood warnings as a lot of rain is heading in on the east side there. South America, the same thing. Very large low pressure developing over Venezuela and then yeah it just day after day but daytime heating thunderstorms popping up I'm sure there will be flood alerts coming out of South America in the next couple days as that large system is brewing I want to thank all my new subscribers from around the world we are almost 4300 I think five subscribers away from 4,300 family members staying aware and prepared. And I really appreciate all of your viewership and your loyalty and your love. And thank you so much. Overlooking Europe, first major system to usher in some cold and quite possibly some, a lot of snow anyway to parts of the United Kingdom, Ireland, higher elevations in Ireland. but also watching for snow in parts of Turkey. Look at our Northern Hemisphere. High pressure ridge developing over the North Pole and the Southern Hemisphere. Thank you for watching today. This has been Mike with Morning Dew. Daily events worldwide. Stay aware and prepared. Stay young and have fun and get your morning dew. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye. If you enjoyed today's video, please hit that like button, subscribe, share with your friends and family from across the world.
Thank you.